Americans are still talking about the unveiling of the Chevrolet Tahoe and Suburban. This move has sparked speculation among GMC Yukon enthusiasts about the potential revamp of their beloved SUV, anticipated to debut in the 2025. And it is happening. Without further ado, here are available details that might help you understand what is expected from the upcoming full-size SUV. The 2025 GMC Yukon is poised to embark on its fifth year of the current generation with a series of design enhancements. The exterior will receive a new front fascia and a revised tail, including updated rear lights. In addition, we're about to see the new antenna fin, boasting 5G capabilities. To further complement these changes, the vehicle will also bring an array of new wheel designs, among which an incredible 24-inch rims. Inside, the vehicle's cockpit undergoes a transformation with an expansive, upgraded infotainment display and redesigned center stack. Meanwhile, the Denali trim will maintain an interior ambience akin to the pre-refresh models, consistent with its luxurious positioning. The 2025 GMC Yukon maintains its stature as a full-size three-row SUV and presents a variety of trim options to cater to diverse preferences. Notably, the selection includes the base model, the advanced model, the off-road-focused AT4X version, the Denali Luxury Edition, and even more luxurious Denali Ultimate variant. Updates suggest that new Elevation and Elevation Premium trims are replacing SLE and SLT, reflecting a possible enhancement in features and status. In terms of body style, the standard Yukon offers ample room, while the Yukon XL extends its dimensions to provide even more space for passengers in the third row, and for cargo, making it an ideal choice for those requiring additional room. The 2025 GMC Yukon maintains its petrol engine lineup with a duo of V8 mils and introduces a fresh turbo diesel into the mix. The 5.3 and 6.2 power plants offer a lot of power, prioritizing performance over efficiency and fuel economy, with the former delivering 355 horsepower and the latter 420 horsepower. Both motors are mated to a 10-speed automatic transmission, available in either rear-wheel or four-wheel drive. The most significant update comes with the diesel option. The new 3.0-liter turbo diesel, known as the Baby Duramax LZ0, replaces the previous LM2 model. It addresses earlier refinement problems, such as reducing the delay during engine startup, and is expected to surpass its predecessor in both output and torque. It fixes another issue, the Baby Duramax can now fit under the hood of the off-road-oriented AT4X model. Experts anticipate a cost increase following the redesign while the GMC is not unveiling the pricing of the new Yukon. The current generation of the SUV is projected to continue in production until at least 2027, with a completely new model expected to debut thereafter. With promising improvements on the horizon, it's safe to say the new Yukon is gearing up to outshine its predecessor. The big question now is, will you wait for the revamped SUV, or are you already considering the Chevy Tahoe, Suburban, or another full-size SUV for your next adventure? Let us know in the comments below. Also, subscribing to our channel helps us grow and create more amazing videos. Thanks for watching.